today let's understand what are the options to restart cloud pc first of all let's understand why do we need to restart cloud pc many times it is required it is mandatory if we been using windows chrome mac os devices even iphone after restart it works better let's understand what are the two options to restart windows 365 cloud pc first is user initiated restart and the second one is admin initiated restart let's go into details of admin initiated restart to perform this action you need to go to intune portal and windows 365 and then cloud pc and select the cloud pc which you want to restart or you can go to devices and then you can search for the cloud pc name and then open that cloud pc properties and on the remote action on the top bar you would see restart option click on that option and it will give you notification that restart is active once the restart is initiated at the client end to confirm this you can go to cloud pc during the testing scenarios at least and confirm it whether it is getting restarted or not the restart is going to take 2 to 3 minutes after that user would be able to connect back to cloud pc using windows app or windows 365.microsoft.com portal now let's check what is the option to restart the cloud pc from a end user perspective So if you go to windows 365.microsoft.com portal and log in with user id then you would be able to see the cloud pc is assigned to you on that you would be able to see three dots and click on three dots and select restart option from there that will initiate a restart of the cloud pc this restart is going to be very useful sometimes if you are not able to connect to cloud pc for some reason you can just restart and wait for 2 to 3 minutes and connect back that would be the first troubleshooting step as an admin or as a end user you can try